this is 413 in this update we have a look at the latest on tropical cyclone CO6B Tipley which is located 312 nautical miles southwest of Calcutta and current position is 18 decimal 9 degrees north 84 decimal 5 degrees east winds 90 knots and central pressure 965 millibars Joint Typhoon Warning Centre has uh, issued their final advisory on the system and it is now weakening and not much of the information has changed to my uh, previous update on this particular system. Shortly we'll have a look at the life of this system and uh, Animated enhanced infrared satellite imagery deep shows deep convection surrounding a defined eye that made landfall on the northeastern coast of India. Tropical cyclone CO6B is close to the edge of the Meteosat 8 Himalayan satellite viewing swaths leading to parallax error and leading uncertainty to the exact center's location or position. A 91 gigahertz image shows a microwave eye, a solid ring of deep convection surrounding the center just prior to landfall. Tropical cyclone CO6B Titney also began to move over land which is eroding the convection in the most recent frames of the EIR imagery. The system is located in the area of vertical uh, wind shear low uh, 10 to 15 knots and still maintains an excellent poleward outflow channel. And now we have a look at the NOAA floaters and various tracks including model guidance or track guidance. The cyclones jogged west-northwest in the past six hours along the southwestern periphery of a subtropical ridge to the east and by now the system will recurve northeast over land as the cyclone rounds the western edge of the steering wedge. It will continue to weaken over land until it dissipates around a 48 hour mark. The available numerical guidance members of entire agreement with ECMWF slightly to the rest of the other models. JTWC forecasts its hedge slightly less than a multi model consensus towards the ECMWF solution. There is high confidence in the centre track forecast and as mentioned uh, this is their final advisory unless there are signs of regeneration. So that is the latest uh, position from the Joint Typhoon Warning Centre. EPS track guidance. They cycle intensity guidance. And one outline uh, indicated a Cat 5. No way, it was just too close to shore. So we know it got to a Cat 1. They cycle track guidance. The HWRF is the green, light green track. And again, it's the GFS model available on the Pivotal Weather website. It's the precipitation 
and the uh, scale is along the bottom of the screen we appreciate your support to the channel and stay tuned there will be more updates across the tropical scene and bye for now you can follow force 13's outlets the website force13.com our youtube page youtube.com forward slash force 13 on facebook under the same name force 13 and our twitter handle it's at force 13 if you wish to get in touch you can also add force 13 on skype and my personal account on discord full 13 at extension 9094